early for crying. Ugh, I'm so tired this morning. I stayed up late last night. Ooh. Okay, I stayed up late last night working and it's not on YouTube stuff. It was like these design stuff and my eyes hurt because when you're looking at the computer screen and it's late at night and you have to finish what you were doing, your eyes will hurt the next morning. So working on logos and website designs right now for people so that's exciting even though i don't seem so excited about it it's too early in the morning anyways good morning good morning blues butt the savior has arrived you're so heavy in the morning let me see yeah! <laughs> he just, he was doing that yesterday while I was on the computer. I looked down and he swing. I'm like, where did you learn that? <gasps> Imported from Mexico. He's a fresh mango. We've got zucchini coming out of our ears. You want to see? This is a zucchini. You cannot get this in the store. <laughs> That's hilarious. And well, here's one. Oh my. Larry the Cucumber. Look at that zucchini, babe. Yes. You know how many loaves of zucchini bread you can make? You better get started. Oh, man. We have That's more in the fridge from the last time. They gave us some, some veggies. And we got some potatoes and onions. I get sad when we can't eat these food and they go, they go bad really fast. Man, that's huge! But right now, I'm actually going to try this whole cinnamon roll waffle thing where you put the cinnamon, you know, Pillsbury in the waffle iron and see if it actually comes out. So, can you waffle it? Okay, so here it goes. So I think you smush it. Make it. Hey. Ooh, the cinnamon kind of burnt a little. One more time. And put some frosting on it, baby. So here it is. I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it. Was it even on me? Mm. So, may I have one before I go? Get them show me gold though. Wow. Whew, so much easier than baking it. That's just meal, Papa. Here, you guys can have some too. That's good. A healthier note, I'm going to have a healthier breakfast. I just want to try that out. Of course I'm going to eat it, but I'm going to slow down on the 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 icing. <laughs> so, so uh, this morning I'm going to have the Pina, virgin pina colada chaya seeds pudding with pineapples. Delicious. Again, if you haven't seen my video, the three toddler snacks are on there. Good morning. Uh, whenever you see this, I just wanted to share with you all the Bible verse of the day. It's going to be a little bit different. Today we had a um, friend, a friend, a church member who passed away. And <clears throat> I just wanted to share a Bible verse with you. It's uh, 1 John 5.13. I write these things to you who believe in the name of the Son of God that you may know that you have eternal life. And the reason why I wanted to share that is because oftentimes we feel hopeless, we feel alone, we feel discouraged, like there is no one out there who understands us. And oftentimes we see other people suffering and we see that they are in the, their last breath. And just for me, having to experience someone literally pass away before me, it, it, it was not a wake-up call, but it was a learning uh, experience to know that our lives are fragile and no one has tomorrow promised every single person is living today because either God allowed them to or because God still has a plan for them sometimes we manage to forget how fragile life can be we take it for granted we scream out yellow up the top of our lungs as if though we have to live life to the fullest and we miss the whole meaning of life God has given us a purpose to be on this earth Others don't have the privilege that we might have. Others can't run around like we can. 
and sometimes we take that for granted and so i just want to share with you guys that don't wait until thanksgiving day to be thankful for the things that you do have um, you might be taking your blessings for granted for example you're watching this right now you're blessed others don't have that privilege so don't wait until thanksgiving to be thankful for the things that you do have and also <laughs> If people believe in YOLO, I don't, I don't know, live life to the fullest according to God's will. Right. Bye. Bye bye. Love you. Love you. Bye. Bye bye. Oi. Oh, 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 oi. Oh, oh, oi. Oh, look at this. Gaia, Gaia. <laughs> Say Gaia Gaia. Uh, oh. I'm making some curry right here. The potatoes are simmering right now before I add in the rest of the ingredients, vegetables, and some bamboo. And yeah, but ooh, it smells good. Luis is gonna go back out so i'm cooking lunch now so he has something to bring don called he said he has five gallons of green beans yes i stopped by he called do me. you want some remember last year they he gave us a whole case of green beans got wasted yeah, we didn't get green beans wasted but the be the green beans <laughs> got wasted and uh, i just trust me i don't like wasting Maybe, maybe Food. Yeah, so We've got a, a freezer full of green beans. I'm not a green bean. I'm not a green bean person. I don't really cook with it unless it's like curry or something, but I don't use it all the time. Does anybody out there want some green beans? You can call me green bean. So we've got amazing news for you guys. No, I'm not like hitting a million subscribers. Thank you for asking. She is hitting, I think, what, five million subscribers now? Just kidding. We're gonna go back to Juneau, Alaska. Um, she's really excited to go visit all her friends and family. So we're gonna take a few weeks and road trip over there and then just swim across the ocean and not a big deal. We're excited to go home and not, well, her to go home. It should be fun. The kids are gonna see all their cousins and relatives and we're gonna go eat pelminis and boba and it's gonna be good stuff okay so it was hard to believe that luis was even excited but when you're excited baby you gotta do this <laughs> Sorry. Mm, mm, mm. see my bun is happy again but i am so excited to go home and honestly it's not gonna be i know we just you know left home but that was a year ago okay yeah. we have no family here so being gone for a year is a long time we're gonna be in god's country <laughs> in less than what two months mm -hmm. in less than two months and i'm just so happy 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 i'm most excited to eat my mom's cooking and get some bubble tea some thai food go to costco oh i'm so excited to go to costco huh yeah bring it back with us <laughs> I'm ex I've never been so excited to go to Costco in my life. Last time when I was vlogging at home, when I first vlogged, I was kind of shy, not gonna lie, because I felt like people were weirded out by it because they're not, they're not vloggers now. They don't understand like me putting the camera in their face and such. So I have more confidence and I have more comfort level because just that's just how it is now when you keep doing something for a while you're just comfortable mm -hmm. sit sit What's in his mouth? <laughs> you can hear me oh it's lint down down oh right down good boy <laughs> uh oh daddy's leaving say bye to daddy <laughs> We'll see you all on Sunday. I'm off to work. I'm off to work. I'm off to, I'm off, I'm off to work. So we will see you guys on Sunday. Take care. How are you doing, Cinderella?
Really sweet. I'm gonna watch that now. Cause now that you mentioned it. But it has to be the Rogers and Hammerstein. Impossible. Or a plain yellow pumpkin to become a golden carrot. Look at it. Impossible. That's a very shoe, but it is a very big. What do you guys think of Louise's new man purse? It's not a man purse. It is. Put it on. Can you like fashion for us? No, I mean, what do you think? I think this thing is pretty cool. Look, it's very compact, very nice, and very light. And, oh, and it's tough. And look, his iPad just sits right in there. Yeah. And then on this one, Bible and such and wallet. Mm -hmm. Wow. July favorites. <laughs> July favorites. <laughs> <laughs> but what I like about it is it's just a compact thing. See? Oh, and, and watch uh, when I'm traveling in the airport or something. Watch this. What is that? Water bottle. Oh, wow. How much did you get that? Where'd you get that at? 15 bucks. Clearance Where? sale. Where? Stables. Check it. Ooh, it's break time for mommy too. Gonna have some curry. That's what it looks like. Didn't even have time to make brown rice. Okay, when you guys are making brown rice and you plan to make brown rice, give at least, what, two hours in advance. At least that's how long our brown rice takes to cook like an hour and a half so white rice it is Luis is not complaining though the one of the best things about this trip is going back home is we get to hang out with my friend from college Jibby because she lives in Denver and we are taking the flight out of Denver fifth time is a charm But we're flying out of Denver and she's gonna we're gonna hang out with her for a little bit, catch up. She gets to see the kids. She hasn't seen them since um, before they turned one. So I'm excited to see um, a familiar face from school and see what she's up to, you know, like girl talk or something. I don't know. Look how creamy that is. Oh, homemade banana ice cream for the kitties later. I'm gonna give it another go at this banana bread. Half of it has pecans and the other half has semi-sweet chocolate chips and I put that cinnamon brown sugar um, coating on top. Now this time I used flax meal as an egg replacement instead of the baking soda. So both of the kids are in timeout. Here's one and here's two. They just did not listen. Now, is it just me or does it seem like whenever somebody's here and I'm occupied when somebody's here, the kids just get all rambunctious and like defiant and they don't listen and they are just rowdy times 10. Is it just me or is that their nature? Do they just know? They, they know when they can get away with things. It drives me nuts. But someone was trying to talk to me and tell me about their their issues and i'm trying to like you know engage and give them advice and help them out and mika and lucy they're like all up in my hair screaming hitting me and if Luis were here whoo they would not think to do that oh. this must have a lot of banana in it look it's it's moist not because it wasn't cooked long enough, but because the banana just makes it so moist. And Mika is crying right now. Mmm. Better. Mm -hmm. So while Lucy's throwing a tantrum, Mika and I are going to eat. We have some veggie hot dog with some lime, tapatio, and Mexican cheese inside. I can easily eat like 10 of these. Come sit down, sit down. Come on. Okay. Oh, 
an hour and a half till Louise comes home. I was just wondering, did you guys notice my shimmery face? I am trying out the new Hard Candy Contouring Trio. It has a bronze, a blush, and a highlight. This one is in 3 times a lady. Have any of you guys tried this product? If so, let me know how you like it because I like it so far. Who's there? Lucy. Uh-oh, it's Lucy. Uh-oh. Let's get her. Let's get her. Let's get her. Do. Do. Be careful you're going to get hit with some poop. Do 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 do. Do do do. I can't do that with Lucy. She's too heavy. So it is dessert or snack time. Some banana bread with banana ice cream. And the whipped cream is for me. I'm going to eat it right away. Ah, yes. You ready to eat? I'm going to say goodnight because I am just exhausted. I am tired and I cannot wait till bedtime until Louise gets home. It's Thursday, so it's... My, my shoulders are heavy from how the week was. But hope to see you guys. See you guys on Sunday and have a nice weekend. And don't forget to check out my fun Friday, my fun Friday video tomorrow. Bye. Say adios. Adios. Mm. Lucy. Did you stuck her foot? <laughs> she just stuck her foot in the dessert. Look at that.